So when it comes down to kata in a tournament, thank you. When it comes down to kata in a tournament, say you're in a Shotokan tournament. Okay? So like I told the first class, I don't talk about this too much. I started in 1979, started competing in about 1980, um, and I retired in 2012. I was 42 when I retired. I competed a lot. In that time, I was on the AAU national team from the, between 21 and 33. I won eight U.S. national championships. I went to world championships a uh, bunch of times, took third twice, gold once. I individual kata. Okay? How you lose at that level, because everyone's good, is detail. So we both do that step punch in the kata. I go square and he goes here and everything else is the same, I'll get the, the flag from the judges. I, oh, nice. We're both doing like say the back stand. So we turn like, you know, out of hand, knee on it. We turn and your foot's supposed to be 90 degrees to your body and his toes out. I just got him. And your thumb sticks out or your hip sticks out. That's how at that level, when you're all good, is how you beat the other person. I, I Your fundamentals are better. <coughs> oh, <sorry. coughs> the details matter the more advanced you get. <coughs> the downside, the better you get, the easier it is to see your mistakes. Right? Right, so it's easier I, to see mistakes. So you gotta be good.